Hi, right, we're, we're here today on Church Street, and pretty soon we're going to recognize Lois Badecki, who was a hot dog lady for 28 years and provided services near this site on Church Street. Uh, we're going to create a, a spot here, a plaque, and, and uh, that will recognize her presence here forever. And I think it's a, a great celebration of uh, a long time of dedication of serving the people of Burlington on Church Street. And of course, uh, uh, hot dogs are still uh, part of uh, people's diets, but I think Lois, for 28 years, was the one who served them up. So it's a celebration here in Burlington. Hey, it's Tim Cavanaugh, and I'm down here on the Church Street Marketplace, and we have got the unveiling of Lois Badoki, the hot dog ladies plaque that is going to be on, mounted on the storefront of Homeport here on, on Church Street. Lois was an icon here on Church Street for over 30 years, serving hot dogs through every type of weather condition imaginable. And it's our honor, along with the city of Burlington um, and, and the, the people of the Church Street Marketplace, to unveil this plaque for her uh, at 12 noon today. Gentlemen, Lois Badoki. from Church Street, years with the jewelry oh, department. Yeah. Oh, we kept, we kept, we kept an eye on each other to see to, <laughs> to, see to what we behaved, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. And we behaved. <laughs> and she, she's the reason kids. why we're out here today, I tell you. you know. Come stand right around here. We've got Lois Badoki, the hot dog lady, with us, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all for uh, braving the elements this afternoon, and um, and thank you for coming out and supporting Lois Badoki. Uh, in 1972, this beautiful lady, who I'm holding her hand right here, uh, came out onto Church Street shortly after a fire consumed the beauty shop that w that she was working in and uh, started selling hot dogs here on the Church Street Marketplace. And back then, cars were uh, on Church Street. There was no, uh, there, this was not a pedestrian mall. And for over pew, 30, pew. pew, lots of smells, she said back then. <laughs> for over 30 years, she weathered through every type of climate you can imagine here on Church Street and every presidential administration since Richard Nixon selling hot dogs to not only the people of Burlington, but the tourists from and all around. We had President Clinton. And you had, you served a hot dog to President Clinton. No, I did not. <laughs> I didn't want to get that close. <laughs> Lo Lois, ha Lois has a rule about interviews, and she says you're never to talk about religion, politics, or sex. Isn't that correct? Oh, God. <laughs> That's true. That's true. We have the Honorable Mayor uh, Bob Kiss here from, from Burlington, uh, our mayor, and he would like to say a few words about you. You have to watch out. Tim can put words in your mouth. 
So, Lois, you spent a lot of time here, uh, 28 years at this particular site. And I know I talked to one fellow earlier, and I said, have you had any hot dogs from this site? And he said, several hundred. <laughs> and, there, and there are probably many of us here who, over the years, had a hot dog from your hand. And that, that must have been a very, very good customer. <laughs> yeah. so, uh, it was. So, Lois, you probably have secrets. I'm not sure if you're ready to tell. But, uh, <laughs> but uh, certainly spending this much time on Church Street, you were uh, more than a fixture. You were something that people look forward to. And I, I know that in addition to selling hot dogs, you gave away hot dogs. And you met needs of people that uh, probably w people weren't aware of, so that uh, Church Street was something welcoming because of you. So yeah, yeah. Cer I certainly. I could always tell if they needed. Yep. Yeah. You know. So I'm glad to be here as the mayor of Burlington, and on behalf of myself as mayor and the people of Burlington, I want to recognize the time that you spent here and shared your life with us and provided services to the people of Burlington and Chittenden County and, in fact, the world. So thanks, thanks, Lois. Thank, Thank you. you That the mayor brought a beautiful bouquet of flowers for, for Lois. And Lois, we have all kinds of activities going on here. Right behind you are your good friends from McKenzie Country Classics. Greg Rule is here with, with his crew of folks. Look at that. Lois always served McKenzie Country Classics. Um, Greg Rule, who is the general manager of, of McKenzie, remembers days when she he would get phone calls from Lois because she ran out of hot dogs, and he would personally deliver them from their plant and bring them right down here. And I want him to know I never served another dog that didn't have McKenzie on her. She's always been proud to serve Vermont's own McKenzie Country Classics. So, Lois, we, uh, uh, they're here because they're going to be handing out over 200 hot dogs to the folks who are here th this afternoon. But, Lois, we're going to take you and the mayor, and we're going to go back to the beautiful Gold LeMay curtain number one <laughs> and find out what's behind it. Sauerkraut. Sauerkraut, right. <laughs> Come right over here, Lois. No, wait. Chili cheese or hot all right, let's do that one more time because you always offered all the condiments and that went exactly how? Mustard, ketchup, relish, onion, sauerkraut, chili, cheese, or hot sauce. Or the hot sauce, all right. And you'd have people who would take it all, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. And she served roll aids, too. <laughs> all right. Uh, let's have you stand right in front of this. We're going to go ahead and read so all can, all can um, uh, admire this plaque. Frank Boucher of Homeport has agreed to have this mounted uh, proudly on his storefront, so we thank him. Frank? He's selling. He's behind the gas register right now. Oh. <laughs> okay, we will make sure that he sees you. So um, behind the, the, this gold of May right here, Lois, you've seen it once before when we had you on, on the show, but here it is forever. Isn't that beautiful? Looks just like that. Let me read what it says. In honor of Lois Benoki, the hot dog lady, for over 30 years of loyal service on the Church Street Marketplace, for more than a quarter century, Lois Benoki served up hot dogs and hospitality on Church Street. Through the landscape and businesses, though the ch landscape and businesses changed, Lois remained a pillar of stability, open rain or shine, Always smiling. Or snow. Or snow. <laughs> and, yeah, we'll make that change in bronze later. <laughs> and full of friendly conversation. She was a city icon and a genuine good Samaritan, showing respect and kindness to all people, from governors to the homeless. Her elegance, compassion, timeless bouffant, and cat-eye glasses have left an indelible memory on this street and in the hearts of those who she met. Lois Badoki, everybody. Anything you'd like to say? I just want to thank everybody who came out today because it's very cold. And it's very, I was on the street, but not really dressed like this. I had on long underpants, two or three pairs, and two or three jackets, etc. on this kind of weather. So I know how easy it is to be cold, cold, cold. So thank you so much, all of you, for coming.
All right, so we have uh, we do have hot dogs, and we have a friend of Lois's who I believe would like to say a few words. Hi, my name is Richard Rago, and I have been a companion and friend to Lois for a very long time. Uh, I have the jewelry card over there. Uh, we've known each other for, it seems like, a, a lifetime, doesn't it? Yeah. And um, I'd like to thank Lois because uh, she is primarily the reason why we're all able to be out here as vendors. Both she and I uh, ended up in a courthouse one day. <laughs> it's a long time ago. Uh, and it was very, <laughs> no, 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 it's okay. We were fighting for our rights to come out here and serve the public and the people uh, as vendors do. And I'd like to personally thank you for that. In, in the name of all vendors who are here now and in the past, thank you very much. Yeah. We love you. So like we said, Mackenzie here um, has hot dogs that we'd like to serve for everyone here and your chance to, uh, to say hi and your thanks to Lois. Thanks so much for being here this afternoon.